O oh Lord, my heart is not proud, nor haughty my eyes. I have not gone after things too great, nor marvels beyond me. Truly, I have set my soul in silence and peace. A wind child on its mother's breast, even so is my soul. O Israel, hope in the Lord, both now and forever. It's a good moment now just to pause, to be silent, and to allow God's peace to come and enter after having read his holy word in Psalm. 130. Hi, so we have just finished reading Psalm 130 and it's also Psalm 131 in some Bibles. Um, this is Lady. Hello, Lady. Yeah, so a beautiful and very comforting Psalm. Um, another one of my favourites along with Psalm 1 uh, or Psalm 23. So, yes, imagine us being comforted by God like you would see a child resting with its mammy and the mammy being so at peace with its wee baby just resting on her breast and sleeping <laughs> and I know that we all need that time to just rest and to be filled with the love and the comfort of God and I love coming down here to this river you know, it's so beautiful and so peaceful. Look how still that water is. Isn't it lovely? So I do, I carry my Bible. Um, let me see if you can see this. Oh my, and I carry it in my bag. Um, that's also something Pope Francis uh, encourages. Carry the gospel with you at all times. Um, read the gospel often. So it's something... Look at Lady just, <laughs> she's resting too. It's something um, that we all need to do maybe more. Uh, carve that time out. It's, um, it's a beautiful thing. I'm nourished. I'm comforted. I am strengthened. My faith is strengthened. My hope is renewed. My love is strengthened by me choosing to um, be intimate with God in His in His Holy Word, um, I'm, I'm I'm very very grateful that I have been encouraged by really good people in my life, um, encouraging me over and over to read Scripture. Thanks be to God for those people, and you can tell that they are actually re uh, reading Scripture often themselves because they have a peace. They have a peace and a faith that is just so beautiful. And you're like, I want that. I want what they have. They carry this peace around with them. They walk into a room and it's a presence that they have that you're like, oh, wow. I, that's so different to what I'm seeing in most places. And they have a happiness, but it's like a, like a very 
gentle happiness. It's not like happy clappy happiness. It's so nice to see. Um, so it's a, it's a joy of the Holy Spirit <clears throat> um, that, that they have. And yes, when I choose to come down to the river or if I am going away and maybe it's a mountain or just a beautiful place at the beach, I always bring my wee Bible with me. It's the New Testament, it's um, the Gospels, the Psalms and the New Testament. It's very small to carry around, like it's only that size. Um, and it's just nice that you can pick it up and know that you're you're with God at all times and being you're being in relationship with God and you're um, you know you're being um, looked after. So I encourage you to to read scripture often and to go into the silence, go into the nature, and there you will find God. <laughs>